I'm Adam from No Rolls Bard, and welcome to Board Game Club, where the first rule of Board Game Club is one day when the tonguing is done, we will take our leave and go. Every week we gather a group of our friends here in our NRB studio to play a board game to show you how much fun board gaming can be. And this week we're playing Tortuga 1667, designed by Travis Hancock and published by Facade Games, who sent us a copy. Thank you very, very much. It's another one of these wonderful little book games, like Bristol, date that I can't remember, like Salem 1693, like Hollywood 1947. There's going to be secret teams, there's going to be shenanigans, and this time it is pirate flavoured. Look at us out here, sailing the seven seas, conducting our yard sails. Yard sails. In this game, players will be on three separate teams, and they won't know who is on their team with them. They'll have to try and find that out over the course of the game. Two of the players will be British. Two of the players will be French. And one of the players will be Dutch, Dutch accent. The whole purpose of the game is to make sure that your side ends up with the most gold. See, there's these two ships here, the Flying Dutchman and the Jolly Roger, and there's also Tortuga. Each of these three places has a French hold and a British hold. And over the course of the game, gold is going to be added to these holds depending on who gets hold of it, who votes a certain way, who leads certain attacks. Now, in this case, one, two, three for the French. One, two, three, four, five for the British. If the game ended and the board looked like this, the British would win. However, if the game ended and the board looked like this, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. If the game ended like that, because there's a direct tie between the teams, that is when the lone Dutch player wins. Obviously, if there were more French, the French team would win. And that's the whole point of the game. Work out who is on your team, work with that person to make sure you got the most gold at the end of the game. And how do you do that? Well, let me tell you. On your turn, you have a bunch of actions you can do. You can interact with these event cards. That's something that all players can do. You can either take two cards, look at them and place them back. You can be brave and turn over a card for yourself at random. Oh, that's bad. You can nominate another player around the table, put out two cards and tell that player, you have to reveal one of those, Sullivan. And the final action that any player can do is move from their ship to a rowboat. Then on another turn, they can move from a rowboat to Tortuga or from Tortuga to another rowboat or another rowboat to another ship. It takes a long time to move around the board like that. It takes your entire turn just to move to the robo. But it is a way of getting around. That's something that anyone can do. Interact with these cards or move themselves via robo. But then we have actions that are specific to your placement on these ships. The two players who are at the front of each ship will be that ship's captain. Yeah. Captains have two actions that only they can do. They can maroon any one of their crewmates to Tortuga. Uh, let's say I'm this captain. Hey, you, get out of here. They can also call for an attack. What does call for an attack mean? Well, at the beginning of this game, this ship here, the Spanish Galleon, will be loaded with four of these treasure tokens. When a captain calls for an attack, they basically say, we're attacking the Spanish Galleon. Everyone who is on that ship with them, so in this case it's red and yellow, they will put in one of their vote cards from their hand. In order to lead a successful attack, when all the cards are taken in, shuffled and revealed, you must have one torch and one cannon symbol. Ignore the rest of the card, only matters the top row. If you have a lit torch and a cannon, You've done a successful attack. Let's say the Flying Dutchman attacks the Spanish Galleon. They're successful. Boop. One gold retrieved, and the captain gets to put it in whichever hold they like. Maybe they'll put it in the French hold. 
Does that mean they're French? Or is that a double bluff? Next up, you have the first mate, whoever is in this position here. First mate has their own naughty little power. They can call for a mutiny. A mutiny is another vote. Everyone who is on the ship votes, and if there are more skulls than there are steering wheels, then there's a successful mutiny, and the captain is marooned on Tortuga. Everyone moves up. I am the captain now. And then finally, there is the role performed by the person who is at the back of their ship. That person is the cabin boy. Now, to be fair, the cabin boy is just a person who's furthest towards the back of the ship. In this case, I am the captain and the cabin boy. And the cabin boy has an incredibly powerful power. On their turn, they can move one treasure token from one hold to another. Finally, there's one final role to talk about, and that's the governor of Tortuga. Whoever is on the highest track on Tortuga, whoever gets marooned there first, is the governor and can call for a brawl. That is, you guessed it, another vote. Everyone who is on Tortuga votes, and whichever of these flags has the majority in that vote, the treasure looks like that. So let's say that it's all British flags, both treasure tokens would go to the British side. Let's say it was all French, then the French would get all the treasure. But if there was a vote and it was exactly tied, they're split like that. No extra treasure ever comes into Tortuga. But these two can make all the difference. And that's the whole game. We will be interacting with cards, we'll be moving around, doing mutinies, leading attacks, trying to get our hands on enough precious gold before the final card in the game, the Spanish Armada, comes out and the game instantly ends and we count who has the most gold. Who will be loudly singing Rule Britannia and who will be solemnly whistling La Marseillaise? Find out as we play Tortuga 1667. Joining me for this nautical episode of Board Game Club, I'm joined by Sullivan. Yeah. I'm joined by Larry. Yeah. I'm joined by John. Yeah. And I'm joined by Tilly. Yeah. We play Tortuga 1667. We'll all be pirates or sailors on the seven seas. We're going to belong to one of three teams. There will be two people on side of Team Brit. Oi, oi. There will be two on side of Team France, Zutalo, and there will be one Dutch player. Clogs, clogs. Yeah. Clogs, clogs, clogs. Tulips and that. Uh, the Brits will win if there are more treasure in British holds and places at the end of the game. England. The French people <laughs> will win. There are more treasure in the French holds Paris. Or, than at the end of the game. And the Dutch will win if it's equal. So the reason why I'm in all the pirate games is that uh, I have no morality, um, but I have a fantastic sense of style. First things first, let's find out to whom our loyalties lie. Loyalty cards. Oh, you're going to make us pick one. Loyalty cards. Oh, you beast. Loyalty cards. Poison Loyalty chalice. Cards. And loyalty card. Tilly. I'm a free agent. Oh, you're saying you're Dutch. I'll join any team. You're saying you're Dutch. Yeah. Let's find out who I am. And I don't tell anyone. That's right. That's right. Yes, don't no, tell anyone. Don't tell anyone. Sully. I'm going to go for this one, actually. Laurie. Well, I'm just going to go for the one the gonna take nearest to me. John. And then for me. Okay. So. We now go into this bag and find our starting locations on these ships. We're going to find out who is the captain of the Flying Dutchman. It is John. Captain John. Ahoy there, mateys. Find out who's the captain of the Jolly Roger. Captain Laurie. Yeah. And we find out who's the first mate of the Flying Dutchman. It's first mate Tilly. Ah. And then we find out who the first mate and cabin boy will be on the Jolly Roger. It's cabin <laughs> boy, first boy, mate boy, Sullivan. Mate boy, Sullivan. And then I guess 
I'm the fucking cabin boy <laughs> on the Flying Dutchman. Swam, oh, swam my poop deck. As it <laughs> should be. Uh, I'm just going to pop that there. All right. So, captains have special powers. Not least being, they start the game by placing Ooh. one treasure in one hold of their choice on their ship. This is the French hold. This is the British hold. Starting with the Flying Dutchman. Um, where are you going, Captain? Is he gonna do the standard bluff or the double bluff? Don't read into it. I can't believe it, but I'm French. We're all French here. I'm a French. I'm certainly French. I'm certainly French. I've got a lot of French pepper. <laughs> a little French pepper. A little French pepper. Oh. We are importing pepper. I've got a feeling this might be Terry's favourite episode of Podcast. I think so. <laughs> Terry is looking at us going, I, thought, I didn't know they were French. I would say that you're trying to do a good French accent that is not sounding comical. Uh, you have to, uh, for me, I just remake every word about as twice the length that it otherwise would take to speak. And uh, how you say, uh, pass the... Uh, and I like, oh. apparently I was speaking to Terry. This is a very French noise to make. <sighs> that is apparently, <sighs> that's a very French noise to make, apparently. I just, I am walking down the streets of Paris. <sighs> now you hear it everywhere. It's loud music to my ears. It's a beautiful language. So far, it's all French doubloons from here on out. Uh, so yeah, we can all uh, we're going to start with you, and then we're going to go clockwise. Not okay. in terms of the people on the ship, just simply clockwise, but you will go first because you are the captain of the Flying Dutchman. A reminder of the things that you can do that anyone can do. You can view two of these event cards. The very last event card at the bottom of the deck is the Spanish Armada. That ends the game. And then whichever the loot configuration is, that team will win. You can view two of these event cards. You can reveal one yourself. Uh, you can point to two event cards and get someone else to reveal one of them, mm. or you can move to or from a rowboat. For example, you can move to here on one turn, then here for another turn. You can uh, then move from here to here, and then from here to here. So move, crossing from one ship to the other does take a while. You could also ask for your captain to maroon you if uh, they want to waste their turn on you. Uh, but that is pretty much it. Uh, when these go, there are new ones added. We start with Captain John. Attack the Spanish Galleon. Yar! Yar! I mean, we're on the Flying Dutchman, so I'm, I'm, I'm all for that. Who, who's on the ship with me? Me, you, and... And Tilly. 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 Yeah? Attack the Galleon? Yes. Attack those rotten Spaniards, yeah. as you always say. I mean, that's your choice, Captain. Yar! 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 Yar. So, this is a vote. What this means is we have to look at our three cards. We're all going to have three. Uh, we need a successful cannon symbol and a torch symbol in order for this attack to go through. Um, you could also put in a water symbol, which cancels out a torch. Water plus fire equals no fire. But if you be doing that, you'd be heading straight to Tortuga. You'd be heading straight to Tortuga, <laughs> you, you can't. Just FYI. Yeah. Uh, of course, everything will get shuffled in, so you won't know who's contributing what, but Captain. This vote is going through. It's going through. I can say we, we're allowed to talk about what we're going to put in. I. I'm gonna. I can only put in a cannon, so I'll put in a cannon. All right. I'm also only putting in a cannon. We need a torch from you. I've Tilly. got a torch. I'll put in a torch. Hopefully, ain't no buckets. Ain't <laughs> no <laughs> don't buckets. Don't know how classic, this accent is gonna continue. Pirate. Yours goes Somerset oh, so no. quickly. Er. All right. So three votes plus one. Ooh. from the random vote pile. These then get shuffled, please, Captain, and then lay them out and we'll see how the vote goes. But we are trying to storm the Spanish Galleon and we will see if this gold ends up, yeah. if we do get it, if the gold ends up in the French hold or in the British. We shall see. We shall see. Yeah, yeah. That'd be a cannon. That'd be a cannon. That'd be a cannon. That'd be, That'd be a, torch. a torch. Don't you fuckers now, random card. Uh... Yar! Yar! So you have successfully, because there is one cannon, 
one torch and no uh, buckets of water have cancelled out this torch. It means that's successful. These get discarded, and you get to take that. Right. So Captain John has placed it in the British side, keeping it all square. Boy likes to be even. Laurie, it's your turn. Attack oh. the Spanish Galleon! Yeah. 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 Uh, everyone who voted in that last one, by the way, takes a vote. Thank Come you. To bring it back up to three. I be able to give ye a torch. Well, that's not good. <laughs> I only have torches myself. Well, well, let's see what happens. What a well lit ship. Heart of the cards. Here we go. Lads, we set fire to our own ship. <laughs> uh, we have no cannons. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Just lighting each other. I mean, we set ourselves on fire. Are we shuffling and we that see was... scare the Spanish? <laughs> hey, Just no your gold. <laughs> right, we got, well, we got a torch. We got a torch there. We got a torch! And we got a torch! Here we go. A successful attack on the Spanish thank galleon. Thank you, Deck. Thank there you, Deck. And, 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 two pirates. <laughs> Where's it going? Oh. Oh, the Dutchman's loving this. <laughs> um, one vote for you, one vote for you. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, uh, so that is, a, that is an action that only the captains can do, and we do have Captain Laurie and Captain John. Yeah. First mate Tilly, what would you like to do? I would like to personally view some event cards. Mm. Which ones? Mm, I'll have a look at these two. Lovely. Make sure they go back in the same order that they came from. Okay, cool. Cool. One, two, Okay, I am going to. You've looked at these two. Mm -hmm. Oh, looky lose. Oh, fun boy. So you've looked at those two. You've looked at those two. Why don't we just do this one? Yeah. He's going to do it? Cabin boy. Cabin boy. Read it out, please. Here we oh, go. Albatross. Albatross, doesn't it? <laughs> doesn't <laughs> sound, sound, good. Good. sound great? Reveal it keeps his card now. for the rest of the game. Oh. All players on a ship with two albatross on board are marooned. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> we should. Uh, Wait, so if, a, any... if another albatross comes uh, comes along, then anyone who is on a ship with, with two albatross on board is going to go to Tortuga. So does that, to go to does that the people with the albatrosses do, or the whole? Uh, uh, any, anyone on board. All uh, all players on a ship with two albatross <laughs> on board are marooned. So, so if someone else picks up that card mm -hmm. and jumps on a boat that you're on. Then why would they, I suppose, because they would instantly be marooned. Yeah, but if they were yeah. sent there or something, yeah. everyone on that boat immediately goes to Tortuga. <laughs> Fucking hell! So, Revealer keeps his card in front of him for the rest of the game. At any point, a ship has two total albatrosses on board. All players on that ship are marooned to Tortuga. <laughs> that sucks! Um, <laughs> if you possess two albatross cards and you enter a ship, everyone on the ship, including you, is immediately <laughs> marooned to Tortuga. <laughs> You are essentially a walking bomb. Oh, <laughs> that is that is very albatrossy. Albatross Incredible. cards have no effect on Tortuga. Why would they? If more than one player enters Tortuga simultaneously, because they were all marooned from the albatross, they reverse their rank order. So mm. Cabin Boy gets best rank spot. Amazing. Captain would get worse. If you get one more, you'll be such a liability. <laughs> Solomon would just, oh, oh, do oh, are you hiring? You Where are albatross? you going? <laughs> immediately the ship crashes. Uh, there's a new one of them, isn't there? Lovely stuff. Right. I am extremely happy with this boat. Me and Laurie, we're just together. We're attacking the Spanish. Sometimes we win, sometimes we lose. But, you know, we're having a bloody lovely time. And I'm sure that he is, is enjoying my company too. I think we're having a bloody lovely time. I, I've just caught the bloody albatross, but, you know, it was, <laughs> it was absolutely, absolutely bloody fine. <laughs> it's a great, he's a great chap. He's a great chap, Laurie. And I, I really do think, I really do think I'm going to win this one. Uh, John, it's your go. Attack the Spanish galley! Yeah! yeah. Well, actually, let me check my cards. I want to All know right. where you're putting this treasure cabin. Um, where would you like me to put it? Uh, well, I want you to follow your heart, Cabin. All right, I will. Uh, I'd I've... like to you to reveal something about yourself, <laughs> but I'm you not first. like to reveal anything about me. What a great deal! Uh, I've got I've got torch and cannon. I'm gonna put cannon in. All right, I'll put torch in. You I've got both, so I guess I'll... put another torch in. Yes, yeah, I'll put another torch in. In case yeah. we get a bucket. Yeah. Okay. So we've got torch, claiming, torch, cannon, torch? Uh, yeah, I think I put a torch in, yeah. Great. Lovely, so that's an extra vote card. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Oh, that's water. Bucket. Uh, 
That douses the fire. That's probably from the random one. Okay. Cannon. Cannon. Yar! Yeah. We're all Yar. good on the flying Dutchman. <laughs> Captain John, please tell me where. <laughs> Captain Laurie. Attack the Spanish galleon! Yeah! Yeah! These Spaniards are getting a real beating on <laughs> Seven right. Uh, oh. Take your votes, extra votes cards back. I've only Shopping. got a cannon this time. Oh, I've got a torch. Oh, fantastic. Right, now we just hope for no war. We're fucking rinsing the Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a torch. That's a fuck. Oh, oh, that is an unsuccessful yeah. attack. I'm afraid. Okay. Take your vote card, please. They're wise to us constantly attacking yeah. them. <laughs> okay. Have we tried water? <laughs> right. Tilly. Oh. Uh, can I take one of the cards? Is that possible? You can may. I? Great. I'd like to reveal this one. Please do. Do we, do we see it when you reveal it? Or yes, I think so, you must. Yeah. Oh. So, the letter of Maki. Is that mm -hmm. how you say that? Re okay. Revealer may send any player on Tortuga or a rowboat to the back of the line on either ship. Or they may save this card in front of them and use it as a later action. Hot is, diggity dog. Nice. Which is what I'm going to do. I'm also going to reveal. I'm going to reveal that. Thank you. Atlantis. Revealer gives this to any other player. Before any player's turn, owner may move from one ship to the back of another. Using Atlantis does not count as an action. Discard after you. So I can basically give this to someone right now. I'm gonna don't, give it don't to, give it to the Sullivan. <laughs> he's got albatross. <laughs> don't enable him. He's not, he's not going through. He's not going through Atlantis. He's being carried by the albatross. <laughs> <laughs> it worked last time. Let's see what happens this time. Number five. <laughs> it's a pistol. Ooh. Re uh, revealer maroons any other player. Who are you choosing? Yeah, right now, do, you have to do it now. Oh no! Uh, let me let me just double. <laughs> Laurie, oh, the cat. The cat is the only other one in the ship. There's yeah. other ships. Oh, can I maroon other? Yeah. Ships? Uh, let, let, let me let me clarify yeah. that for it's, you. It's got a really long scope on it. The pistol. <laughs> Get off the ship. You are, you over there. Get off your ship. Reve what? <laughs> Revealer points to another player. Any player. Mm -hmm. That player is marooned on Tortuga. Pistols cannot be saved to use as a later. Action. Are you marooning? What? <gasps> no, get on the <laughs> Why? Get on a Tortuga! I said I will, but why? <laughs> I will. I, I put in both holes! Your jib. I put, well, you don't know where my jib is. <laughs> I, I deliberately, have any I deliberately in my jib. On you go. <laughs> oh, get fucked. And I like my captain. We've had a nice time. We attacked the Spanish. We didn't use it very successfully. Time. Yeah. 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 One time, yeah. Oh, well, you got away. I've gone. I've gone. <laughs> Sullivan, why are you marooning me? Just leave me on this ship and I'll put the gold where it needs to be for my team, which is probably your team. It's, who knows? Just go away. You're weird. I'm Maroon John because he put two things, uh, two little gold treasures on onto the, onto the French side. And you know what? I just don't think that's fair. I'm not saying I'm British or French or Dutch. I'm saying it's not fair. It's not fair. I don't think it's fair. Do you? No. Of course you don't, unless you're French. Not, not that would be a bad thing, because I, I could be French. Turns out, Tilly, there's an opening at the top of this I've ship. I've been promoted. Captain Tilly. Captain Steel. Would be a fucking Captain amazing. Captain Steel is right. a great sounds name. Right. This sounds rad. sounds right. I'm now first mate and cabin boy. I can mutiny <laughs> against no. you. I wouldn't, though. You've no, got one of those promotions that didn't come with a raise. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Someone's oh. just left. Can you do their job as well? Yeah. Uh, I right. believe you marooned me. I, I chose reasonably at random. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I've done nothing but rob the Spanish. Something well, we can all agree is fine. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, that is a pretty cool thing. <laughs> I'm with pirates. Well, uh, Governor, it's up to <laughs> Governor Gracie. <laughs> so, okay, so I can get on a rowboat. You can get on a rowboat. You can start a brawl to um, basically you do an it's another boat. Yeah. And you can try and move um, and one would, of these just across me, the other. Yeah. It'll be you voting against the the deck essentially. Yeah. So you're hoping for a. I'm I'm pretty happy with how everything laid out at the moment. Uh, I might just I might just roll them bones and get a card. So we're, this is the mystery card, right? That no one that's just that's just come back onto the board. Yeah. Maybe it'd be an albatross. 
was a pistol. <laughs> well, wow, 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 you know. <laughs> you point, from here, you pointed a gun at me and I <laughs> sheepishly got into the sea and then I rushed up on shore and I'm like, oh, a pistol. <laughs> no, Sally's, absolutely get on the island with me. walking towards the pistol. <laughs> I think it was quite rude. Yeah, quite rude. Um, for him to maroon me like that is um, extremely, extremely rude. Um, uh, I, I, I'm going to make a complaint uh, to, um, to the Admiralty and, um, uh, uh, and then eventually, eventually we'll have this, this absolute water, this absolute water of John Gwaisi uh, marooned from the world. Laurie is now <laughs> the captain and the cabin boy. Everyone else is gone. <laughs> does make attack in the Spanish quite tricky. Mm. <laughs> it does. Oh, could you put a new... Certainly love to. Oh, right. But let's attack the Spanish anyway! <laughs> Wait, so you need to get the other card. Good luck. Yeah, I'm going to attack the Spanish. Let's see if he's done it. What have you put in? Right, let's find out. Okay. All right. Attack. It would have oh, anyway. I oh. could do it on my own. <laughs> I didn't need this stupid cabin boy. <laughs> what a fucking captain. <laughs> da, da, da. Oh. Interesting. Very interesting. It doesn't matter that Sully's been marooned, because that's the thing about the Jolly Rogers captain. He is the strongest captain to walk, to sail the seven seas. He will take the Spanish down. <laughs> Just so everyone knows, now that the Spanish galleon is, em is <clears throat> empty, captains can still launch attacks. But attacks will not be going for the Spanish captain. There's no more gold there. We've burnt that <laughs> We've ship. We've sunk the ship. Fucking embers. Uh, instead, you'll be launching an attack on Laurie's ship. And if the so attack doesn't go through, you'll be taking a hold, uh, gold from any one of his holds that you like and Amazing. adding it to your ship. Amazing. Uh, captain Tilly. Ah. R indeed. Do you want to do an attack? What? Get, get one of his, get some of his yeah, gold. get some of your gold. Why wouldn't we do that? Where would you Where put the gold? What else can I do as uh, captain? You could maroon me to Tortuga if you like, or you could look at cards and, uh, or you could tell me two cards to pick from, or you can do uh, all sorts. Be pretty funny. Yeah, be pretty to. funny. To it would be pretty funny. Excellent. <laughs> I'm glad that it's doing funny. It? Uh, do do as you please, Captain. It is your turn. It is my turn. Yeah, Marina, I think that's me. Tortuga is filling up. I don't like the cut of your jib. I don't understand. So much jib related criticism in this game. Peace out. My jib is so nice. I don't know what team you're on. Can't read you. Excellent. Get out. Okay. Get out. All right. Get to Tortuga. I'll get to fucking Tortuga then. I just maroon Adam just based on vibes. He gives me a sort of requiring a gluten-free breakfast kind of vibe, and I don't really want that on my ship, so he's out. Okay, well, seeing as we're doing things for uh, the bit, mm -hmm. Sullivan. Yes. Pick one of them. So, so you know what that one is, right? I do and know you what don't that know what one, this is. one is. Yeah. Oh. Would you like to know what that card is? Oh, yes, please. What team are you on? <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell you. Okay. Then I'm not telling. All I can say, all I, all I will say is it's either good for you or it's bad for you. What I will say, Sullivan, is he doesn't know what team you're on and he knows what that card is. Uh -huh. I, and he definitely doesn't know what this is. Yeah. Which suggests that this is a positive card that he would have told you about. Because mm. he can't put you in this direction because he doesn't know what it is. Mm. So he wouldn't, if he, if he wanted on you on your side, he would have one good and one bad. Mm. Well, that's what I would do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Suggest him to me that one's good, unless it's a big bluff. And if it is, I'm sorry. It's an albatross. <laughs> <laughs> Life at sea isn't for you, Solomon. Make yourself a home on Tortuga. <laughs> Getting dragged away by birds all the time. He just can't go on a boat now. No, I, every, I can. No, he can. Any time he does, everyone, everyone comes off the boat. <laughs> and you have an ability to warp yourself to the back of any boat at any time. Oh my God. <laughs> what have you done? Oh uh, dear. I've got to say, um, at one albatross, very hard to deal with. A uh, two albatross, uh, this is going to be a bloody nightmare. Uh, I really, 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 I, I, I hope that everyone enjoys these albatrosses because I'm going to be going from ship to ship to ship to ship to ship, showing them my albatrosses because you know that's all you can really do at that point once you've got two albatrosses. <laughs>
Um, all right, let's uh, <laughs> clear off. Oh, you, you got what? You got, oh, you're using your power? I'm using my power. Shit. So, so that doesn't count as your action. Wait, that means you and Tilly both which go to Tortuga. Which means Tilly comes to Tortuga, which means that the captain goes the other way and you go. Uh, so hang on a second. So you have warped to Tortuga. Mm -hmm. Which means that you're promoted. Which means I bump up and then you come back and Tilly takes the worst option. Great. <laughs> so you're stuck on Tortuga for the rest of this game. Y yes. <laughs> <laughs> but you can at least drag people down with well, you. I can drag people with me. <laughs> Look, we're all on Tortuga, I'm in love with you. Hello, Laurie! <laughs> you can maroon, uh, with a pistol, you can maroon someone. It basically pops them all, the way. like for example, if I pulled a pistol on John, mm. uh, you go all the way, you've essentially been marooned again. Right, You right. go all the way back down, and if you're marooned whilst on Tortuga, you permanently lose one of your vote cards. Oh my god. If I'm marooned, and so would that have to be a pistol? Yeah. But we can't mutiny against... Or the black against, spot. We can't mutiny against the governor. Uh, <coughs> essentially, using a pistol on him does exactly the same thing. You, oh, so there's yeah. not an but action. We, but we can't call for a mutiny. No, no you no, can't. No. You basically have to either convince him to take the black spot, which is a mute, which is an automatic maroon, or a pistol, which is another maroon. Okay. Well, I may as well just keep on going with these cards, eh? <laughs> oh, El Dorado. <laughs> Revealer gives to any other player. Owner immediately draws an extra vote card. Owner may play two vote cards in any one future vote. Discard El Dorado after playing two cards in a vote. Well, I liked my Captain Laurie. You can have Thank that. you. I love that no one knows what team anyone's on. No, yeah, it's just purely like we had a nice time. Well, Sully likes British Laurie. Maybe. <coughs> Sully, Laurie put an nice. extra thing in the British and Sully, Sully likes him. That is not conclusive so at you're all. French. But it's something. Sorry? So you're French? Not necessarily. Wait, are you Dutch? No. I think just, I know just something, just something to think about. What do, what do you think everyone's on? I'm not going to say because I'm sneaky. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that is my go. All right. I call for a brawl. Yeah. Let's do it. So that would be everyone but Laurie. Everyone votes on this, yeah. And, and then we'll put be, one of those then, in. So this will be the random vote will go in as well. One, two, three. Uh, everyone apart from Laurie, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's just Tilly and Adam need to put oh, in a This will be some very useful info. Whose side are you on, Tilda? Let's find out. Let's. We'll learn some very useful info. Where were we? Maybe we'll just be confused or by the random am one. We. <laughs> or am we? I have a suspicion about you, Sullivan. I have a suspicion about you. Oh, really? Well, I have a suspicion about Tilly. I think it's very interesting that your surname is Blanc pied. Sounds pretty English to me. Sounds a bit oh. too English for me. <laughs> <laughs> too English for my blood. <laughs> All right, here we go. Number one. Too English. Too bloody. That's a fucking English. Oh, well, no, I'm a, yeah, looking here. Right? That yes. could have been the random one. Could be random. that we've got a very British person. A very British person. Which would be terrible. British. One English. One English. It's Sorry, very British. unlikely it's going to come back to the French. Oh, my goodness. It's a very British island. Oh, bloody hell. It's What's, is that sad? Well, you sad there's well, only one? Sad, about, sad there's only one? About, about the French, French comes out. Uh, oh, oh you're sad about the French. <laughs> now then. Ooh. So we can't all be British because uh -huh. there are four of us and there's only two. Mm. Did you so, just go, uh-huh? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. <laughs> the, truth, <laughs> the truth is, so, people what? might not have had the, the thing that they want. It, it, you can't Maybe. have three British people on the side. No, but mm -hmm. one could be random. And the other one's It could be both British and the Dutch are on this island. Yes, that that's true. Little lorry French boy. Interesting. Little lorry French boy. Yeah, I feel like we've got a random, which could be any of them, but likely one of the British. I, I, I imagine one of the British is random. So of us four, one of us is French. Probably two Brits and one Duchy. Mm -hmm. That's my thought. That's my which thought. Which means Laurie's French. Laurie. As French, French as a French leg French. of frog. A leg wow. of frog. You heard. <laughs> I did. That's what we call it. Does them. this gold go over to the British side then? Well, let me explain. In the case of a brawl, if it's majority British, Oi. both treasure goes Oi. to the British. Mm -hmm. If it was majority French, both treasure would go to the French. And if it was exact, even voting, <clears throat> they, split. they split. Interesting. So right Interesting. now, the Brits are winning one, two, three, four, five <laughs> against three French gold. Mm. And that's how many cards are left in the deck, just saying. Interesting. Right, these cards get shuffled and all get, everyone gets one apart from Laurie. How do you feel about that, Laurie? How do you feel about what? 
what the, the big thing that just happened. Fine. Yeah. Laurie had his headphones in. Just at the front <laughs> of the ships. Yeah. On the good <laughs> ship. <laughs> Laurie Pops. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Outstanding. Eating raclette. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Tons of baguettes. No regrets with raclette. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely not at sea. Laurie, uh, Captain Laurie Pops. Captain Laurie, who's also the first mate and also the cabin you're boy. Captain is uh, also the cabin oh, boy. Oh, great. Fabulous. Thanks. That's coming out for you. Okay. Okay. Who, me? Would that be French? Why'd that be French? Why, why are you going to say to me that that would be French, Terry? I'm clearly not French. Just normal captain here on the sea. The French here on the island now knows their ally. Mm -hmm. Useful to know. Maybe, unless it's like a, a massive bluff. Like if the other French person didn't have a card and played British just to try and maybe what? lure something. What I'm saying, different. the other French person has to be on the island. There is definitely a French person on the side. Yes. That so is 100%. They now, the French team now be... know who each other, or well, one of them knows who their team mm, is, is yes. what I'm saying. So the French are dangerous. Maybe. Maybe. There could be two French people on this line. It's not impossible. That's all I'm saying. Mm. It's more like... Are you saying Laurie Dutch. could be Dutch? Laurie could be Dutch. Sure. Tilly. Um, <laughs> scum of the island. Yes. Tilly Steele. <laughs> it is I. What would you like to do? Flopping around in the dirt. <laughs> <laughs> I was a captain once. Sucking up the dirt into Sucking my mouth. Sucking up the dirt. <laughs> yum. Yum, yum, yum. Horrible stuff. Delicious. <laughs> Sucking up the dirt. I'm gonna look at some cards is what I'm gonna Ooh. do. Look at some cards. I'm gonna look at this one, first of all. Lovely. Du -du 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 -du. Oh, I think this game is good, you know. Mm-hmm. I agree. Oh, oh no, no, we killed the whole of Tortinga! <laughs> all dead. A giant <sighs> descends upon Tortinga. Don't worry, I remembered I was in second. Giant cuff <laughs> sweeps us into the sea. <laughs> Lovely. Good cards. Oh, he's heading over there. Strong stuff. Looks like I need to pay him. An old friend. <laughs> well, oh. people are starting to wear their colours <laughs> white it's on their chest, aren't they? Popping over, right? Hello, old chap. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen these? <laughs> I know a lovely island destination for us both. <laughs> <laughs> Outstanding. Right. Well, the boats are full, so I'm not going anywhere. Fuck me, I guess. Yeah, you cannot get on these boats. I'm stuck on this <laughs> shithole with Tilly, who's been eating dirt. Could take a card, I guess. I think I'll have to. Um, does anyone know what this one is? No, find out. Let's find out. Let's find out together. No, find out. Oh, it's a black spot! <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, back to the end of tour two, you yeah. go. <laughs> and unfortunately, that means you permanently lose one of your vote cards. Do I choose which one goes? Uh, yes. Oh, fuck me, running. If you're already on Tortuga and you get marooned again from a pistol or a black spot, two things happen to you. First, your pawn has moved to the back of the line of Tortuga. Uh, the pawns are right behind you moved up. You have successfully managed to feed it in the dirt <laughs> yesterday, and now you're... Everyone's I'm a winner, left. baby. <laughs> and Everyone's always left. grifted. Oh, oh, shit. Second, one of your vote cards is chosen at random by another player oh, and no. placed unseen at the bottom of the vote card deck. Oh, you will play with fewer oh, vote dear. cards for the rest of the game. If you are marooned multiple times, you will lose multiple cards. Yeah. Fuck, if you lose bad. all of them, you may still call for a vote, but will not get to participate in it. And you know what? Since there is a new governor in town, I think it should be Tilly. Mm. Yeah, I'll choose one for you. So everyone's left. You've you turned around to Tilly and gone, oh, well, I still got you here. She's gone, I'm in charge. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Spits the clods from her mouth and puts a gun on me. One of them's really good. Please don't take that. <laughs> yeah. Which one's that? I don't know. I shuffled them. Uh, I'll take this one. Thank you. So that goes. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. These suck. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> what will become of Rock Brasiliano? <laughs> uh, so this goes. Oh, I can't believe I drew the black spot. Whoopsie, poopsie, <laughs> pirate poopsie. Uh, right, Captain Laurie. Ah, uh, I hear the curl calling of the birds. <laughs> I think my time is short. I'm just oh, gonna move that fuck. over there. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Tilly, as governor of Tortuga. <laughs> New, very recent governor of Tortuga. You could pick up one of those cards that you looked at. Or you can I nominate could. someone else to take them. 
You can nominate someone else. Yeah, you take basically take two. two cards and you get someone else to choose. That is one of the ways. Basically, you can camp in these boats. Mm. You can just sit there and wait it out and no one else will be able to get. So which is, if someone is doing that, you generally give them, you do that to them so mm. that you might maroon them again. Mm. Because, yeah, otherwise it is possible to basically <laughs> lock these treasure in for the French. <laughs> Love the Sullivan's heading over. So ominous. <laughs> Hello. He's <laughs> him rowing towards Hello. the boat. I like that. <laughs> Just so many dead birds. See, I think he's not rowing to it. Like a little swing <laughs> attached to two albatrosses. It's just... Come on, my beautiful, beautiful albatrosses. Take me to him. <laughs> Get off the ship. I'm going with. Okay, wait for me. Wait for me. Wait for me. I'm, wait for me. I'm lonely. <laughs> I'm insufferable. This ship, this ship must be empty at all times. I hate your pirates so much. <laughs> Good lord. I'm uh, going to play this card. <gasps> She's playing it. This is Black Powder. Ooh. Revealer chooses to destroy one rowboat <gasps> that may not be used for the rest of the game. Fuck, what if someone's on it? Well, I think we'll find out, but yeah, I'm no? pretty sure they're going back to church. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. Um, Does that mean that you can't get onto that ship ever again? Yeah. Okay, uh, reveal a place the explosion token on either rowboat. That rowboat may not be used for the rest of the game. If a player is currently on that rowboat, they are marooned to the back of the line of Tortuga. The only way to move to a ship without its rowboat is to use the letter of Mark or Atlantis. Uh, there's your there's your explosion, Tilly. Thanks. So you can maroon Sullivan or... <coughs> Wow. Mm. Okay. Welcome back to T Town. Tilly locking in, essentially. I mean, that one's worse for the French, for the English, mm. the British that's rather. A, that's mm. a, that's if, a, if you had to play one. a card, that suggests to me that you're not British, or she might be Dutch. Care to comment? I do not care oh. to comment at this time. Okay. Thank <sighs> you so much. Uh, Black Powder <laughs> use. Pleasure playing with you. Yeah. That's phenomenal Lord. stuff. That ship is fucking just blown up <laughs> with me on it. I just land in Tortuga. <laughs> well, you never guess where I am. But... <laughs> uh, my We're go, all about to kill Tortuga pretty soon <laughs> once Sullivan gets up. <laughs> 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 fucking hell. Um, right. The fuck can I do? Um... Oh, I'm going to look at these two. Okie dokie. Salam. Hello, friend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, off we go. <laughs> ah! There we go. We're all here. Oh, God. <laughs> it's my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> what have you all got me? <laughs> I hope it's not an albatross. I've got some of those. I've already got some of I those. I love it. You <laughs> dragged us all to a desert island because you were a bit lonely. <laughs> <laughs> I've got two albatrosses already. I said to my mother, I don't need another albatross. And there she goes. Gets me another one. Two all albatrosses, right. but four friends. <laughs> God, I'm in a bad way. We're all in a bad way. I mean, I can't step foot on a ship. <laughs> Sully's <laughs> landlocked. I'm landlocked. Everyone <laughs> to a desert island. <laughs> the logic of it is so funny. As soon as you step foot on a ship, <laughs> everyone. Everyone's like, oh, fucking, we've got to get off. <laughs> and I'm like, where are you going? You come with them. <laughs> as soon as I get onto the ship, they all. <laughs> where they are all, you going? Where are you going? I'll come with you. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, I thought get we'd get away from him in Tortuga. What are we doing today, best friend? <laughs> Uh, John, you're done. Oh man, I don't know what to do. Cards, I guess? Maybe. Or you could look at them, you could pass them on to someone else. Um, I'm gonna, I guess, uh, I'm gonna move here. Oh! Up I go, do do do. Oh, look at these two. Hmm. Good stuff. Well, now I know what. Now I know which one of them is the right one. Yeah, but which one is good? They're pretty good. Dilly. Yeah. <laughs> You're going to call yeah. for a brawl. You can, or you could take one of these cards, or nominate someone else to take them, or use your letter of mark. Or oh, I forgot about this. So, what does that do? It, Revealer may send any player on Tortuga or a rowboat <coughs> to the back of line of either ship, or they may save this card in front of them and use it as a later action. Oh, you can send someone to a yeah, so you could send mm. someone to a boat. You can send someone to the boat that no one can get to. I mean, that would be amazing. You <coughs> basically control one of the boats. 
I hope you're on my team. <laughs> <laughs> we'll soon find out. Am I able to move treasure, though, is the thing? Yeah. yeah. yeah if, if you are the cabin, cabin boy. If you, as long as you are the person furthest back, which could be the, cab the captain if you're the only one on it, you yeah. would become the cabin boy. Okay. Oh, that'd be so good. Let's... You have blown up the only way to get onto this boat, and then you can get on yourself and be like, hi. <laughs> How many of these are there? Three. And I've already used... Uh, we've had one, we, an Atlantis had has one. come out, but uh, so far we've only encountered one. Question, sorry. Tell if I go to this boat and then John comes on after me, can I still move treasure over or is it...? No. John would be the person furthest behind. It would make John the only person who could move treasure. You could, of course, maroon John. Yeah. I'll, I'll put it wherever you want. I don't want to go back on the island. <laughs> Please, anyway. Please, I should be back. There's a guy with birds. <laughs> I hate him so much. <laughs> This but if crazy. I go on here, I can't get back to Tortuga, can I? Oh, unless I suppose, you get marooned. I suppose not. Yeah, unless, unless you black spot yourself over. Me. That's true. You'd basically control a lot of the game. But you can, mm. yeah. You Might can. be a bit boring, though, yeah. to be stuck there. What you can do is find another one of these and bring someone who you think is on your team to your boat, and then you've got voting power on your yeah. boat to try and steal all the gold from the other boats. Oh, yeah, brilliant. fuck it. I'm going to go here. I don't know. I'm going to go here. You're going to use Climb, letter, your letter? Button. We'll see how this plays out. Boom. Fuck yeah. So, is that an act? Is that your action on your turn, or is that a free action? That is uh, your action. Amazing. I'm untouchable. <clears throat> or am I? Oh! Whoa. Can you use it immediately? Yep. Oh, you put Laurie on. I sure have. Oh. It's so Adam and Laurie the French! Aha! Vive la France. Vive la France. So we got a new card. All right. Uh, we got a new card, all right. Well, regardless of what team you're on, uh, help me move some of these across. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. I mean, not Adam and Laurie. Obviously, you're dead to me. Oh, shit. That's the card I just got. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. No, no, no. They're all wasted. They're all gone. No one's ever getting. No one's ever getting here. Yeah, that's no fine. That's good for you. That's fucking brilliant well, we for can us. Just, we can just steal some from it. It, it. Yeah, I mean, isn't that... Uh, we? Back we? In the day. Yeah, he's definitely on my team. <laughs> oh yeah, bring him on board with you, see what happens. No, it's fine. He can, he can watch. <laughs> <laughs> he can watch you just relentlessly just like try and steer into this shit. Oh god. Go on. Yeah, go on John, you can be the captain. Yeah, That's you can fine. be the captain. Can absolutely you be the captain. There's two of it, us. My boy. <laughs> yes, fine, I'm British. What do you want from me? I like roast beef. I like fish and chips. I like mushy peas. I like pickled onions. I like jelly deals. I like cream cakes. I like, I like souffle. That's not British. Ah, I got you. That was the odd one out. I like fucking Terry. What's some British food? It's jam sponge. Pie. pie. I like pie. I like jam sponge. I'm as British as the day is long. Look, we're all bad guys here. We're all, we're all colonial people. Don't judge me. And there's no good people here. What? Better to be Dutch? I don't think so. At least I'm not really tall. Uh, my turn? Yep. Yep. I'm eating dirt again. Don't mind me. Come to No, it took me so long. Oh, that took ages. It's a fucking nightmare. Do not worry, there is plenty of space for you on Tortuga. Oh god, that took so long. For the rest of the game, yeah. No, that is for the rest of the game. Um, oh, okay, I think they've won. Fine. I honestly, I don't. think I think they probably have. Um, but let's keep on playing. <laughs> Laurie, go. <laughs> uh, what will I do? Oh yeah, Laurie, just spin, right? You, you did the I did that. Yeah, I did. Oh, the you did the so it's now Tilly. Tilly. Hello, Tilly. C can I go to the rowboat? Is that a thing that you, you can go to the may. rowboat? Yeah. You may. Okay, off I go. Bye. 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 <laughs> See you later, guys. <laughs> you moving up? Bye. Yes, please. See you later. Have a good time. <laughs> oh, you hate this island. I call for a brawl. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna play Eldorado. I get to play two cards. All right. Fuck yeah. Oh, I shouldn't have given it to Laurie. Oh, well, that's annoying. Uh, Hello, old chap. Boop. I was just pretending. Boop. <laughs> boop. Boop, boop. And unfortunate boop. We might get lucky. We might do. My bill. Wait, you, you might be Dutch, though. I'm not. I'm British. That means Tils is Dutch. Yeah, Tils yeah. is Dutch. 
Because guess what? I'm fucking British. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you probably didn't realise this. <laughs> you right. my roast beef. <laughs> British? My British. dad. England? Ah, oh, beef of France. <laughs> Why not? Oh, I don't mind that at all. England? Oh, England? Oh, oh. Beef. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but you're done for France. Wait, wait. Oh, for Ugly France, I guess it's a tie. Well, you know what? That's, that's that just okay. robs one from their that's stash. Oh, it doesn't, it doesn't keep it as it was. No, it's, a, it's an exact tie, so it... They balls, go like that. Balls, that's balls, annoying. Balls, that works. Balls. That works. That's fine. That works. Uh, take a vote card, please. I get two, please. Please do. Draw back up to three. So, Tilly, for the time being, hmm. maybe help us ask plucky Brits out. Uh, oh, yeah. Help the Brits. Help the good guys. Gotta, gotta love the Brits. Uh, oh, yeah, of course, you only have two. Yes, I've only got two. Sorry, Thank you for reminding me. Oh, what a, what a stinky pair of cards those are. <laughs> Um, mm-hmm. <coughs> uh, whose goes it? Uh, it's, it's, it's my go. Okay, um, well, there isn't a huge amount I can do here. We could start looking at cards to help each other out. Slash, yeah, that's a pretty good point. Slash destroy our enemies. I mean, you might also might be Dutch, but I don't care at this point. I'll take any allies. So if you if you trust Sullivan, he can look at these cards and tell you what they are. I think right and now... Be, and, you could ch- and you could pick one. Yeah, right now we are on the same team, but I don't know if he is British or Dutch. Um, you don't want to go for, uh, I think, yeah, uh, well, mm. I'd stick to the other three. What's that? I'd stick to the other three. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> don't want to give away too much information, yeah, sure. but actually also at the same time, just don't bother with those two. All right, I'm going to look at another two, because I haven't looked at cards all game. I want to know what that feels like. That's that one. Mm-hmm. Mm. Interesting. Interesting. These are bad cards, right? Tilly, pick one of those. Why the hate? <laughs> <laughs> it's the fucking Dutch. Why the targeted <clears throat> attack? Come on, just, you know. Albatross. Oh, fucking hell. Mm-hmm. Just got Albatross. Wait, are we nearly at the bottom of the deck? It's mm-hmm. the last card. Oh, fuck. Yeah, yeah. It's bad. Bad times. <laughs> so good. Is that. No, Tilly's got Is it my go? Tilly's your go. Oh, fucking Wanna hell. go on the ship? I guess so. I'll probably get immediately pistoled or something. Which card did Tilly choose? That one. That one's the black spot. Gotcha. This one's the black spot? That's the black spot. Are you immediately going to give me the black spot if I... Sorry? If I get on the boat, someone's going to just get me off it. Uh, I mean, yeah. If you don't get on the boat, though, you won't do anything. Well, this is true. Which is fine. That's what Sullivan's suggesting. No. But Stay what if there's a magical card that can help me? There might be. Could go for that. Yeah. I think the best thing to do is to redress the wildly out of balance state of the board. I mean, if Personally. I get on that boat, I'm not going to be able to do anything, am I? It's, it's our best chance. Okay. I'm going to try and get there, but. Okay. I'm here. Yeah, because you're essentially having to work with the British now. To yeah, pick one of those. Mm. Uh, well, that's the black spot. Yeah. I don't know what the other one is, but well, I, I do. <laughs> is it is, is it worse is it than the black spot? It's not great. <laughs> <laughs> is it an albatross? Why, why don't you say what it is? You may as well. It's an albatross, isn't it? Yeah. Or do you want? I don't think it matters very much. <laughs> I know what that one is. Adam might be lying about that one. If no, the... I know what I that one. Know, oh, you I do. Don't think yeah, yeah, lying. yeah. God damn it. Mm. All right, fuck it. Let's get albatross. No, no, it's... Oh, oh no! Spot. Um, Back you come. At least you haven't lost your vote, I suppose. Mm. So that is now. This is the Spanish Armada. Fucking hell. These get shuffled. Oh! Oh, oh that's, that's fucking balls. That, my only knowledge was where one card was. <laughs> fucking hell. Okay. This is brutal. I do not know why you are mm. so keen to not be French. We have beautiful health care. We have... A fantastic education. We have the best food. No, we right. have You're already the winning. Best Shut people. up. <laughs> you fucking you don't have us. the best people. You've got Parisians. I am a Blompier. Oui, 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 that is, that is true. Yeah, but, thank uh, you. As thank a Blompier, you. I must uh, stand with the French. We are historically French for thousands and thousands of years. You blew up the only boat to get to the other treasures. I just thought it'd be fun. <laughs> it'd be <laughs> much worse if you blew It would have been so much worse. Much worse. This, this was the right choice because yeah. this keeps things more, like kind of locked, semi even Yeah, not that I'm really into equality or anything, no, but you no, know. No, no. Clogs, clogs. <laughs> clogs. Am I clogs. right? Clogs, clogs. Clogs, clogs. All right. Uh, so it's your go. <sighs> Don't really much I could do, is it? Um, 
con on governor. Oh fuck. I may as well just pick up a card. I just that hastens the end of the game, which I really don't want. I know. What what else you can look at the cards. Get on the oh, yeah. get on the You can look at them and suggest. The problem is Sully can't go on. Like, Sully can't go on. Go on. No, so I, I, go on I get kicked yeah, off straight away. But, so. you, but you could, you could look you at could them. You could look at them, yeah, and tell. Help me. Yeah. But maybe find a way to do that secretly so that they yeah, don't know yeah, which yeah, ones yeah, are good. Right <laughs> Fucking hell. I mean, I'm not sure we're coming back out of this, Brits. No. The Marseillaise is going to fly over this land. <laughs> oh, this okay. has been really rough. Yikes. The slow death. Of Tortuga. Uh, yeah. Uh, look at another couple of cards and see what see what's about, I'd say. Or you know, or choose one and just go for it. But I don't think either one of them are gonna be helpful to us right now. I'm heading here. Oh yeah, yeah, may as well. It's neither of those. Great. <coughs> Shit. It's a one in three shot then. Oh, so they want to hit the Spanish Armada. Oh, we want this game to end right now, please. You might as well look at two, then we know exactly which one it is. Well, it's Tilly's go first. But I mean, that's what I'm saying for your go. Yep, for sure. What are you going to do, Tilly? Well, well, should I just play a random card? Fuck it. Fuck it. Oh, we we don't really want any of these cards to go. <laughs> because... I do you want me it... to look at some cards, Well, then? you know it's not here, because... Well, I don't Laurie know Laurie has no reason to lie to me, because otherwise I'll just pick one of those. I think he's got reason to lie, so that I might pick one. Maybe. Personal. As, Unless as he forgot as I, I was here, which you know is possible. The Dutch, uh, the Dutch be Dutching. <laughs> I think our only Dutch. hope is to slow things down. So, okay. So I can start. Okay. I'm so. just going to take from this side and then the other end as well. Such a long pause. Okay. Which ones have you checked? Okay. These two. These two, right? Okay. No more press elimination than they're going to get it, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Just keep it under your lid. Ah, oh, which one is it? <laughs> I think it's this one that I would want to choose out of the two. Mm -hmm. I, think. I hope I remember this correctly. If I have Let's find out. I've fucked it. Ah, oh, I was a black spot! Oh, no. <laughs> Solomon! Damn it! <laughs> oh shit. I could have... This game I thought was that was only three black could, spots. I could have honestly sworn it was the other way around, but maybe I got that wrong. Okay. Okay. That's annoying. Um, There's no way to come back from this really, is there? It's well, don't resolved. choose the other one. <laughs> the other one's not great either, but... Um, I'm heading? Yeah. Yeah. I've spent so much of this game trying to get aboard <laughs> the Jolly Roger. I mean, they, they know which one. Right? Yeah, they, they've already got it. Sunk. Hey, the Spanish. The game is over. Mes amis. Bravo. Uh, now reveal your loyalty cards, <coughs> please. I was, of course, a French. I was French. French. Mm. British, British. England. Dutch. This couldn't have gone any worse, if I'm honest. I'll tell you what, uh, it, uh, it reminds me, it reminds me of um, when I was in school and um, I, I, had a, I had a jolly good friend. His name was Bingo. And I said, Bingo. Bingo, do you want to play some, some, some Wagga with me? And he said, oh yes, oh yes, I'd love to play some Wagga with you. And, uh, and, and he did, and he cheated. And that's why I imagine, I imagine that Adam and, and, and Laurie have done today. They've given me a couple of albatrosses, uh, and it's a loss for the British. And quite frankly, quite frankly, this is an outrage, and I, I, I think I deserve a, a compensation. Well, I don't speak French, so I'm going to hand it over to Terry. Merci d'avoir regardé notre épisode de Board Game Club. Rejoignez-nous la semaine prochaine pour Sushi Go Party. Get-vous en 3, 2, 1. Get on board!